unboxing. Um, and I hope I have enough minutes on my phone. Um, my phone's pretty cool, actually. This is my newer phone that I have haven't had for all that long. And it actually tells me how long I have left. Like how many, like how long I can record before my uh, phone is full. And my other phone didn't do that. It didn't give me any kind of a warning. It was just like, hey, surprise, we're going to turn your camera off because it's full. <sighs> Does this one have a, okay. <laughs> my gosh, I was like, there's plastic on it. I can't even see it. Does it have a plastic lining? Or, you know, on the outerness? It did. I just didn't see it. Anyways, we are unboxing Diamond Art Club's one of their new releases. Now, I ordered two of them. Only one of them came. I contacted them, and they were not sure why that had happened. They were supposed to contact the shipping department and get back to me. I haven't heard back from them yet, and that was, like, quite a few days ago. So, I might have to, like, reach out to them again and figure it out because um, this is the one I'm giving away in my raffle. The other one is the one I really, really, really wanted for myself. Um, and I missed out on this particular artist last time because I didn't decide in time. This time I bought it at like 11 o'clock Saturday morning. So I didn't, yeah, anyways, hopefully it'll send soon so that I can show you that one too. But this one is going to be going to, um, oh, the raffle that I'm doing. If you're not familiar with the raffle, um, I have a Etsy store that sells uh, mainly cover minders, but there's some other stuff on there too. Anyways, um, everything that you buy in Shine Shop Designs, in the link, it's shineshopdesigns.com. I will put it right there for you. It's very easy to remember. Um, but... For every $10 that you spend, you get an entry into my raffle giveaway. That raffle giveaway is, has, it'll have three Diamond Art Clubs in it. My gosh, I can't get this out. Um, it'll have three Diamond Art Club paintings. And when I say like Diamond Art Club paintings, I don't mean like they're all going to be like the little snack sizes. No, I mean full sizes. This one is big, you guys. This one is 51 by 97. So, and this will be the main giveaway in that raffle. And I, I'm not kidding you. I have never in my life <laughs> struggled so hard to get one of theirs out of the box. Like, I am pushing. I open to the other side. I am pulling and pushing. Okay, I finally got it. Holy cow. I don't know what the deal was. It was just maybe so many drills that it just made it, like, packed to the brim but my word that that took like a long freaking time okay i'm gonna put the drills aside but here they are so yes there is quite a bit of drills um the the uh kit that you get with diamond art club it is ooh, i'm not gonna take everything out but you get a clear boat that has a funnel so if you're a messy person or just you know need that little extra help you get two of these heart waxes um this one is a six placer there might be a three in there but i don't think i see one and you get a pen with a little squishy and then some cheap little baggies so that is what you get in a round kit which this painting is round if you were to get a square kit you get everything in there that comes in this one but you also get a nice pair of the tweezers so um, yeah, okay, I'm gonna put that back in the box, like, right away, because this one is going, like I said, this is gonna be in the raffle giveaway, so I wanna make sure everything gets right put, put right back in there. Yes, I can speak. All right. Anyways, but I am excited to see this one. I have seen, um, it unboxed on somebody else's channel, and I was like, ugh! So pretty, and I believe it's sold out, you guys. I'm pretty sure it is. Anyways, this comes in there. It's a step-by-step -step instruction, so if you are new to diamond painting, this is really awesome because it gives you, like, nine steps to how to complete your diamond painting. It gives you um, a thank you code so that when you purchase next time, you can get a 10% off. Um, it also has, I swear I saw something over here, tips and tricks 
for your project. So it gives you some more little pointers and tips. I don't need it, so it's going in the trash, but uh, I definitely suggest if you are new to, um, to check that out. Okay, you guys, I'm going to roll this backwards like I always do. However, I am going to say this. I am not going to be able to show you the whole thing at one time. It is too big. Like I said, it's 90. What is it? Um, it is 51 by 97, guys. Holy cow. Centimeters. That's a long painting. And it's not like, you know, some of those ones that were really long, but they were like only 40%, like 40 centimeters wide. Nope. This one's a full 50. Full 50. It's big. This one is as wide as the one I'm doing right now is as long, so it is big. Okay, so we're gonna have to do it, like I said, just little bits at a time because I can't get the whole thing on there. I will get as much as I possibly can and then we'll just kind of work our way up. So, are you ready? Are you ready? Dun, 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 dun. And ready, ready. Oh, ooh, ah. No, seriously. Oh my gosh, she's so pretty, you guys. Oh my gosh, I want to see if my camera can go any higher. Oh my gosh, I am not kidding. She is stunning. Oh man, for those of you that are into this, oh man. Like, I am not super into the movies or whatever else. Um that this one is like themed by, but oh my heaven, this is beautiful. And the colors, like everything, everything is so stinking pretty. So this one is called Here Comes the Bride. It is a round with a bees. It is 20 by 38 inch or 51 by 97, 97 centimeters. Um, this one has 29 different colors, 29. And two of those are A, B. So here's the sticker. So you can kind of see the whole thing now um, on, you know, because I can't show you the whole thing of the actual canvas at a time, but isn't she beautiful? Like those purples and those teals, ah, oh, I could just, oh, I can't handle it. I can't handle it. Uh, symbols, I will get to that, but they're all, you know, pretty, pretty much the same Diamond Art Club symbols. Okay. Absolutely beautiful, isn't she just beautiful? Okay, we're gonna kind of like work our way up here. Go to the second half of it. How should we do this, hmm, how? Let me see, I'm gonna actually kind of fold it gently. Here we go, there we go. Now you can see the bottom of her dress. This dress is so stinking pretty, you guys. I am just, so excited for whoever wins this raffle because you will not be disappointed. I promise. Okay, so they are doing something kind of new, Diamond Art Club, um, with the way and how they put their information on their canvases. And I have to say, I am very happy that they're doing this because they are now putting the actual artist on the canvas, which as I said before, is awesome because I think those artists should get that recognition. And sometimes when it's not on the canvas, we forget who it's by, unless there's a telltale, like Maddie Manzano, you can tell her work. It's very obvious, but some of the other ones you can't. So um, they have this, on the bottom now, which is, it. they have the thumbnail, and then they have the information. So here comes the bride, all that is what I just told you, but it also says Manny Manzano, and then Diamond Art Club down there. So that's really cool. And then on the bottom, it also shows you like all of their links to like social media, um, and you wanna make sure you follow them because they do give like coupon codes and like announce when they're doing like the Bobo sale. Um, it also says lifetime warranty, which is awesome. It says your canvas comes with a lifetime warranty and free missing diamond protection. So that means if they don't give you enough, you spill them, they get damaged, they will cover them. Uh, the last diamond painting I did, I ran into that problem. I did not get enough of them and they just said, okay, what was the order for, from it? And then they sent them out and I got them in a couple days. So very, very awesome. Customer service, always say thumbs up. Um, yeah, it's just stunning. Okay, we are gonna take a look though at where these ABs are placed. 
So the ABs are um, the symbol one and two, which is very, very common. And the number one symbol is 126 and the number two is 141. 141 is probably the most common AB you will see. It is white. But even though it's white, it is absolutely a stunning, stunning white. Um, so where are the ABs? Where are they? Hmm? They are like, okay, so the two and one is all in this area. I'm going to bring you down a little closer. We'll get some, some up a closer and personal here. Um, all of this, like the white and the uh, really, really like light purple, like really light purple surround her head and it gives it gives you the glowing effect it really does it's really really pretty so like yeah all of this area ab's are just all over there um it's over here in this purple chunk over here and there's some down in here with this purple chunk same with this side like all this like purple area right here there's a bunch of ab's and we go to the bottom half of the canvas. Um, let's see about her dress, like the middle of it. Hmm. Yes. So there's a ton of ABs down her dress line through here and uh, through in here and here. There's a ton of whites all through that area, you guys. This one is going to be absolutely breathtaking when finished. I... I'm very excited for whoever gets this. So yes, again, we've got them in her dress. They're lining all this white lining you see going down all through here. All of this white, that's all ABs. All of this white is ABs. So pretty. Um, and, and also, for those of you that might be unfamiliar with diamond painting or diamond art club, you see these lines right here. These lines to... Like, some people would say, ah, ah, that's a river or a bubble. No, it's not. It is just the plastic. See how they disappear when you pull that plastic back? The canvas is poured glue, and it is absolutely stunning. There, I've never heard of or seen a bubble or river in poured glue. It's just very, very, very unlikely that that would happen. Um... So their canvases are just absolutely beautiful and they're they're flawless. As you can see, very, very sticky. And I'm going to pull you in nice and close so that you can see their symbol clarity here. Uh, let me put this plastic back down. Oh, very important to keep that plastic down. Okay, I'm going to flip you around and we're going to look at the drill, uh, or I mean the symbol quality. Okay. So you can see, like we'll even go nice and close. Look how clear those symbols are. You can really work on their canvases without any um, light pads. I do it all the time. Sometimes at nighttime it's a little harder, but though, because it's just light, darker in the house. But um, any other time of day, like you can work on them without a light pad, especially when you get to these, like, um, the lighter areas like this. Yeah, they're, they're just super, super easy. And because this is a, uh, a round, it, you don't have to worry about getting them just like perfectly aligned where squares you, you know, you would, but yeah, this is so pretty. I mean, I just, yeah. And all their symbols, let me show you the symbols. So here's the symbols. So there's one and two. Um, they're very, very standard for Diamond Art Club. Like all their symbols are, you know, pretty easy. It's funny, we were talking about different names that people have for like different symbols because sometimes, you know, sometimes they have a name for themselves, like percentage sign, or it's a letter or number or an arrow or arrow or something, but like um, like for this one town, where'd it go? I just saw it. Um, oh, now I lost it. Of course I did. Ah, oh, come on now. I just saw it. It was on here. Oh, here it is. This one, I'm like sideways top hat. Um, yeah, there's this one I call the snake eyes or the pill. Um, I heard from some people they call this one the hazard sign, which I love. So, 
it's kind of fun to just come up with like different names. This one I believe only has one arrow in it, which is nice so that you don't have to worry if you do turn your painting around, which I do. Um, you don't have to worry about trying to figure out where those arrows are. And as far as the triangle in the corner, same thing. There's only one of them, so that makes it nice. Um, and there's only 29 colors. So really for a painting this size, not bad at all. Now, the other thing I was going to look at is if is it confetti or is it color blocking? If you are new to diamond painting, the um what I mean by that in confetti it means there's lots of numerous colors where there's they're just like sprinkled kind of on the canvas. And um when it's called color blocking, that's pretty self-explanatory. It is blocks of color together, like these white lines, you know, that kind of thing, color blocking. So I would definitely say it's got a fair amount of confetti in it, but it also has a fair amount of color blocking in it. You're definitely going to be living the 310 life in this one, which is the case with all Mandy Manzano's, but you know, that's okay. But yeah, there is a lot of color blocking as well as some confetti, as you can see here. This would be considered color blocking. And I would even consider this color blocking. But let's get into where I was just looking. So the dress definitely has like some color blocking, but definitely has some um, confetti mixed in there. So as Mrs. Coffee would say, it's respectable confetti. So um, it doesn't make it super, super hard to work on. Um, I think this one people have been waiting for a long time um and i think they nailed it out of the park absolutely beautiful mandy manzano did a great job and then diamond art club took it ran with it they charted it up absolutely beautifully i love these colors i love this like glowing purple effect um and then the the blues and the teals like ah so so pretty okay we are going to put this away and we're going to look at the drills Okay, if you don't like that sound, this would be that time where, you know, plug your ears. <laughs> put, put it on mute, I don't know. Okay, like I said, you guys, holy cow, you are going to be living the 310 life with this one. Here is two of the 310s. I wonder how many they are going to be total, though. Um... Here, we're gonna start at the other end of this one. Ah, I just broke it. <laughs> okay, we'll go from right here, I guess, then, won't we now? All right, we've got 939, and how many of those? On this line, we have one, two, three, 939, and then over here, um, I'll just rip this part off. So we've got three here. And one here, so we have four 939, um, two 823s. So far we have two three uh, three 310s, and then we've got, so two, three, four, five, and six. So six large bags of black. Yes, of the 310. Okay, we will do the rest of this one. So this one, Seven ninety-seven. Beautiful. Look at how beautiful those drills are, you guys. Gosh, they're just so pretty. Um, then we have thirty-three or three hundred and thirty-four. Five ninety-seven. Thirty-seven sixty. Two of those. Three twelve and three twelve. So you got two three twelve. There's gonna be a lot. If you like blues and purples, like this is definitely a kit for you. Definitely, definitely, definitely. Okay, <laughs> now we got a really long train over here. We've got 605, 996, 995, 820, 799, 3865, 519, 796, 3755, baby, 126, so here is that really, really light purple. And my goodness, so pretty. Look at that. Oh, just 
takes your breath away. It's so flippin' gorgeous. I just, oh, I love the ABs so much. Okay, then we have 210, 3811. Wouldn't this one be gorgeous in an AB? Oh, my word. Uh, 340, 155, 3841, AB, and this AB is 141 again, so absolutely gorgeous, and by the way guys, we are in the end of the day, but we're still in mostly um, natural light, I do have one lamp on, otherwise it would be pretty dark in here, but like, it's very true. I can look at it in person and then look at it through the camera, and it's very true to color. So, 3746. I love that purple. So stinking pretty. 775. 333. And last but certainly not least, 598. Um, so, definitely a lot of absolutely gorgeous purples and blues. Um, then you got those dark colors, the 939s and 823s and 310s. But, yeah, you look at this, and I don't think anybody that can't handle the 310 life would buy it because it just would not be a wise decision um, because there's so much black. But, man, look at her. Look at her eyes. Look at that face. So pretty. Ah, so jealous of whoever is getting this canvas. Oh, man. And I, I, you know, I'm not get it, probably get it to the person before the big in painting a thon kind of starts. But I would consider this one like a contender. I mean, it's 97. It's pretty close to 100. Um, this would be a really, really good one for that uh, a thon. That we're, not a thon, but like a long. That's the word. It's the um, big in along so it's like like the truck along it was like grab a big this one is grab a big old painting you've got and we're all gonna work on them together as a group there will be prizes and all that stuff um diamond art addiction is doing it with someone else and honestly at the top, like right in my brain i can't remember who's doing it with her i will try to remember guys and get that in right here but don't kill me if i don't remember um, <laughs> to do that. But anyways, um, I think that's about it. I hope you guys enjoyed this unboxing. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. If you didn't, that's okay. Um, but I would greatly appreciate some constructive criticism so I know how to get better. Um, other than that, don't forget you are braver than you believe, stronger than you seem, smarter than you think, and you are definitely loved more than you know. So with that, keep on shining. And I'll see you next time. Bye, guys. Thank you for watching. And if you haven't already and would like to subscribe, don't forget to hit that subscribe button below and the bell icon to be notified when I put up a new video.